hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is me showing you guys um me using a black owned product line so i've already washed and deep conditioned my hair so now this is the leave-in conditioner i slowed it down a little bit so you guys can see the consistency but it pretty much looks like you know a creamy type of leave-in conditioner so i'm just putting this throughout my hair i am going to be um blow drying my hair and giving myself a little trim nothing dramatic um and just showing you guys how this stuff works um and what my hair looks like after i get done blowing drying my hair so just continue to watch as i blow dry my hair and the review will be at the end all right um so don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and I will catch you guys in my next video. All right, bye. Just rubbing this on my ends but it dissolves so buttery it's like literally butter but it dissolves so simple and easy even though I know my shea butter does but it's like not this smooth <laughs> the one that I make is not this smooth so it feels really good really moisturizing and I'm just a fan of butters so I love love, love how thick and creamy this is I can't tell what else is in it though like I smell the shea butter but it seemed like it's something else I know it gotta be oils in here but it's like a like a peppery type of smell I don't know I don't know I really can't tell what's in the other products um, with this I love how soluble it is go ahead and put this hair up uh, let me figure out how I'm gonna wear this tomorrow after I just blew it out, I mean, for me, I could give myself a half a pep down. But my hair feels so soft. It feels so soft. Like, like I can't believe how soft it feels. It's so flowy. And so whatever she put in, I believe it had to be the shampoo and the conditioner, the deep conditioner. Because the shampoo, it, was, it wasn't slippery or it was like... Um, how do you explain it it was I mean because it was mixed with aloe so the aloe in it made it stay still it wasn't slippery or anything it didn't slide it didn't fall it wasn't messy so I was able to put it on my hands rub it and then go to work the first time that I started I'm looking a little crazy but the first time that I started to wash my hair it didn't um, suds up which is the usual with shampoo it usually take the second wash for it to actually set up um, but at first I was like okay is this gonna do anything because I feel like I kept having to put more um, 
on my hands but the more I wet my hair the more it started to become sudsy and I was actually um, hearing it and feeling it and then once I rinse it off y'all it felt squeaky clean like I don't um, put the shampoo on my hair I just let it run through but my scalp and my roots here y'all when I was washing it and I rinsed it I'm like oh my god I literally got it clean um, in that one wash um, without it even sudsing up but I just went ahead and washed it another time and yeah so it was it, it did its job it definitely got my hair clean um, and then I moved on to the conditioner which I love the fact that she has a shampoo and then a deep conditioner because I usually go from shampoo to deep conditioning anyway I skip the middleman I do not condition condition my hair and then deep condition I literally whatever conditioner I have I just leave it on my hair for however many minutes so I'm glad this this was strictly a deep conditioning conditioner so I put that on my hair um, it had great slip I was able to detang detangle my hair really easy um, and then just feeling it on my hair my health hair felt really soft afterwards and then I got out the shower I just let it sit um, and then finish working it or whatever and I washed it out and my hair felt so soft afterwards like really soft and then that's when I started to blow dry my hair and I realized like my hair using the leave-in conditioner I didn't even need to use the shea butter to put moisture back in my hair after I blow dried it it didn't feel dry or brittle or anything it literally felt like I put moisturizer in my hair once I put the leave-in conditioner in it's like I didn't need the shea butter so my hair felt really 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 soft really moisturizer moisturizer didn't feel dry or anything and as you can see in the clip that I was showing you you are able to see the shine so you, that's how you know it was moisturized and everything so I am impressed with whatever is in um, these products I think it will definitely go a long way the only thing I would say is um, to give it like a nozzle um, so that way it's easier to squeeze it instead of constantly having to pick it up and pour it. Um, but a nozzle definitely would help. Or is it a nozzle? A pump. A pump would definitely help just to be able to pump it out um, while you're in the shower. And then instead of, you know, picking it up and constantly doing this. But other than that, I really love this. I love it. It's not out yet. Um, I was reviewing it for... Um, somebody and I was like yeah I, I try it because I know what their hair looks like so I know that whatever they put in they, their hair then it got to be good whatever they're putting out so I was excited to try it I'm glad that I did um, whenever you do put your product out um, obviously there's no name or anything like that yet but but whenever you do I'm definitely gonna be purchasing and buying this product um, like I said it's it's definitely along the lines of what and how I want my hair to feel and the things that I put in my hair as far as the shea butter and how I want to skip from the shampoo to the deep conditioner um, so yeah guys that is my review um, I know y'all like uh, we don't even know what this is we don't know where it came from we don't know who did it like how we gonna get the plug just wait on it but I'm just letting y'all know it's definitely black owned um, and from what I hear she will she will be um, promoting and put her stuff out there pretty soon so I don't want to give too much away because I don't know how soon I don't know the date or anything like that but but once I find out and what she wants she tells me then I will tell you guys so that is all um, I just wanted to show you guys the products. I did not record me getting in the shower and actually washing my hair with the shampoo or the deep conditioner because ain't nobody got time for that, okay? Nobody has time for that. Um, I don't know how YouTubers get in the shower, wash their hair, and still look glamorous and cute and like this water is not hitting them in the face and in the eyes and the shampoo ain't in the eyes. Look, I be looking all kinds of ways. My, I be like this, it be burning, I be like this with the towel and just trying to... I, I don't know how you do it. So kudos to you. Maybe I'll figure it out one day, but I couldn't figure it out and... Maybe. It was, I couldn't do it. I would have just set myself up for a whole bunch of laughs and like, this girl don't know what she's doing. Um, so yeah, I would just tell you guys that the shampoo and the deep conditioner was amazing. It was amazing. But anyway, that is all I have. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, then leave a comment below and I will, um, of course, answer them and get to you as soon as I can. Like, I got something to do. I'm going to get to you as soon as I see it. Um, but yeah, just don't, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Peace, love, and hair grease. Okay?